morning guys how you doing it's 9 33 <coughs> sorry <coughs> oh, man, i mean i to talk i'm not sick it just creeps up on me um i got ready nice and early this morning pete left at eight o'clock and ashley got up at eight and she left already she left around quarter to nine because she has an earlier shift today so i decided to get up showered and ready but i've also decided I'm taking today as it comes and I'm sorry if I came across as whiny yesterday I just was so tired yesterday that I hit that wall and I just can't get past it and I in my head is going around everything I have to do and I want to get started on the league stuff or the orders downstairs but Pete wants me to leave it till next week because then the following Sunday not this Sunday but a week from Sunday we have the little ones which is twice the amount of kids and he wants me to do it all together now I get it because you put it all through put the charges through put the money in all at once but it's a lot of work um, there's a lot of people but he hasn't downloaded the, he's downloaded the pictures but he hasn't made his pics yet so there's really not a lot I can do because I have to enter each and every kid into the system and put in which package they ordered and all their information and that's another double check on if they missed stuff off the forms I did briefly go through the forms and called parents for information that was missing but I have a handful that the coaches had the kids fill out the forms whose parents weren't there so I don't even know if they want pictures but we took them because the coaches said to so anyway on that note my point today is I'm just taking today as it comes I'm gonna go downstairs in a little while I'm just gonna go sit in the living room I should do some bookkeeping I may I may not I just have to I just have to, to go with it Katie's coming later on and Ash will be home probably around four o'clock it's going right from where he is now over to the school because he wants to get the second half of the uh, Recycle men's are outside. I heard all this crashing, but it's because they're putting all the bottles and stuff in the back of the truck. But yeah, Pete's gonna go get the second half of I think it's JV soccer. So that's that. So I'm just watching some vlogs and catching up, and I'm doing what I really enjoy to do. And this is basically, um, and obviously, I'll answer the phone if because that went crazy yesterday. So maybe we'll get some calls today, maybe we won't. But everyone asked me for recommendations on vlogs and I am so happy to share vlogs I like. Um, this is Jenny and Scott and you definitely, definitely should check them out. They're so funny. Jenny right now has me in stitches because they're waiting for something. I think her prescription and she can't sit still and that's how I get. Especially if I'm in the middle of a store. I did it with my mum when... We were waiting for mum's prescriptions when I was in England. I'm constantly going around going, oh, and then I find things I need. But uh, definitely give these guys a go. There they are. Just wanted. I didn't want to get Jenny half in the shot and half out. There she goes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, her cuffs are off. Hey, your cuffs. <laughs> so we're going to sit here and be two good little people. That's easy. We'll reverse them. But it's cold there. Speak for yourself. Mitch, she'll go again in a minute. Yeah, she's gonna be bad. Dorothy? Oh, I could already. For what? There she goes. <laughs> oh, we're finally done. The channel name is Scott Gerber. Definitely go give him a, a look and see if that's a blog channel you would like to subscribe to. I found them a couple of weeks ago and they really, I really enjoy their vlogs. So anyway guys, on that note, I'm going to go continue to watch. I have Mr. Louie over here. There's Missy and she's something that has to get put on my list because look at her little face. It's full of food. Hello. She needs a bath. She needs a bath and a trim. But anyway, guys, I will talk to you in a little bit. Bye. To have someone this close, that means I have food. Right, Rox? So I do. I have a bagel with cream cheese and a cup of tea. And I'm going to watch Dancing with the Stars from Monday. And Q.
keep going with YouTube. This day's going along just how I want it. It's only 10 after 10, so we're doing good. Hello, Luigi. Hey guys, hope you're doing well. It's 3.30. I just saw... Oh no, it's 3.23. I just saw Katie Zan come, so... I tell you, actually, I didn't see it come. I heard it. I don't know. This guy that drives the van, he drives like eight consumers home, I think, or clients home, and his music is always blaring. I can hear the dum dum dum. Um, but yeah, so she should be over soon. I did go in the office and do some bookkeeping. I hate bookkeeping. I hate doing them with a passion. So I took the dogs out because I knew Katie was coming. Ash isn't home yet and I haven't heard from her so... Well, she's out now but she usually calls us. She's walking to a car or something. But I had a huge fight with a massive beetle bug. I had this window open and I saw this bug and I was trying to decide... I'm petrified of bugs. Insect, I don't like them. I don't care if they're small, big. Spiders, I can't. So I got the shakes inside and he was climbing up the window and I thought, oh, he's on the outside, so that's okay. But no, he was in between the screen and the window and he was up on this thing. I don't even want to touch it. Two dads out of him and because it's a beetle with the hard shell, it wasn't going anywhere. So I took some cardboard and stood up on a chair so I don't flick it into me. And I flicked him down and I think I got him outside, but I don't know. I think there was two, so I'm going to have to have Pete spray the outside of that window because I'm having a lot of flashes just thinking about it. I hate bugs. Hate them, hate them, hate them, hate them, hate them. And uh, they make me nauseous. I get the shakes. I don't care what they are. I don't like those big coffins. I don't like any ants, anything. I don't, like I said, I don't care how big or small they are. But anyway, I am waiting for Madam, so I will touch base with you soon. You guys are awesome answering these questions. I'm glad you like it. Um, so I can reveal, I came here in 1982, and I have to say, a lot of you got it right. I give away things in my vlogs. You know, I turned 50 this year. I came a week before my 19th birthday. So process of elimination, you guys got it, so well done. So now we'll think of a question for today. I don't want to make them too, too obvious because then they're not fun. But I don't want to make them too hard that it's like a chore that you have to go back through endless amount of vlogs to find the answers. So there's a lot of stuff I talk about all the time. So I'm going to really try and make them about that kind of stuff because I don't want you to have to go back and feel like it's... <laughs> a test or anything silly like that. Ashley gave me a challenge. Um, our sub, sub numbers are going up really nicely. They go up and down on a daily basis. Like I gain like six and then I go down three or four and then I gain some and I lose some. So Ashley says to me, it would be nice if you had... Now this started off as mine and Ashley's channel because she was more into vlogs. I was never into vlogs. And we used to watch all the regulars like Shay Tart, the Shay Tart and Charles Trippy and all that. Sorry, I'm looking out the window at the same time. And here she comes. But so Ashley and I decided here comes Katie. And they got cable, internet, and then eventually And anyway, so she said, let's do a vlog channel. And I said, okay, only if you do it with me. Ash has given me a challenge that I have to get to a thousand subscribers by Christmas. That's two months, two and a half months. So let's see. What happens? Anyway, I've talked to you in a bit. Katie's going to ring the bell any minute. Oh, there it is. Hi, guys. It's 10 after 7. Pete's home now, and uh, we're just going to heat up the rest of the meatballs for dinner. There's a couple of rolls left. I wanted Ashley to do the new question, but when she got home from work, Kate was here, and then she left right as Kate left. So, um, and I can't video when Katie's here, really. So, Ashley decided the question for today. It's her turn to pick one. So, Ashley's question is, what month is her birthday? So, you have one in 12 chance of getting it right. <laughs> she was going to ask you how old she's going to be, but then she wanted to ask if you knew what date, what not date, but what month her birthday is in. So, there you go. That's today's question. Um, Pete's got one more day at Conair. We were going to go see the band this weekend. They are playing at Giant Stadium. It's always a great show. It's a little bit pricey to get in. I think it's like 
$30 a ticket, but they're actually playing early. They used to go on at night, and I know the times when Ash played there, uh, yeah, when Ash was with the band, they would go on at like 10 at night, but they're actually, their performance is at 3.24 or 3.27 precisely, um, and the award ceremony is at 4.30, so it's an early one, so I don't know if Pete can go actually, because he has a football game on Saturday to go to. So I told him just to let me know. I asked him why he threw out all the Christmas decorations and he said there was a bag that had stuff in it and it was moldy, mildew, so that's why he got rid of them. And I said, would well, you know those Christmas decorations in there? He said, no, I just threw the whole bag out. Wouldn't you kind of want to check what's in the bag before you threw it away just in case there was anything in there that we needed? Not peace. If it's decorations, you couldn't care less. The less he has to put up and deal with. Tomorrow, really, I can't go anywhere because Katie's coming over early because she doesn't have group. She's going to come over at 1 o'clock. Um, and Ashley is working anyway for the next few days. She's working through Tuesday now. So she doesn't have a day off, so we can't really go off and do anything anyway. So this way, if she does want to do something earlier, we can go do it. But Usually when she works a weekend, she likes to just get up when she wants to and, um, you know, just relax before she goes in because Saturday nights are usually quite busy. I want to go back into the city. I want to go to the English store and go get some goodies, but um, that's not going to happen until at least the end of November, I think. And um, I've got a little bit of bacon left, which I took out of the freezer yesterday, but now because I don't have it and I can't, I won't drive into the city myself, but um, I want pork pies and stuff, but it's not going to happen for a while. What I might do is go on that English site actually, not that I can get pork pies because it comes from England, but I might just go on there and order some supplies. Right Roxy, what do you reckon? And that's about it for today guys. I've been really haven't done any anything vlog worthy so I feel like today's a bit of a bore and I apologize for that. But I haven't been anywhere, I haven't done anything and Ash and Pete were gone all day so it was just me and the dogs until 3 o'clock this afternoon. I didn't even eat lunch, that's not good. I had my bagel for breakfast. So I'm going to go heat up those meatballs now, put them on a roll, have that for dinner and um, that's going to be it for today. And tomorrow's October 4th already. Time is flying by. Miss Claire, it's so good to see your vlog today and have you back on on uh, YouTube. It's good to see. It's good to have you back. You have certainly been missed on YouTube um, by me. I know we've texted now and again, but it's really good to have you back on YouTube. And uh, we will put a link to your channel in here so people can come by and say welcome back and a hello and for everybody that doesn't know you they will get to meet you so I love the car vlog I love to see you in the car chatting away and um, please know I'm here if you need me guys we hope you're we me and the mouse in my pocket we all hope you're doing well hope everybody's having a great day tomorrow is Friday thank goodness for that um, I'm ready for the weekend, catch up on some sleep I guess because everybody will be working except me this weekend, but that's okay. <laughs> anyway guys, have a great one and I will talk to you tomorrow. Bye.